Hey guys, welcome back. Today we are up at uh, Cheddar Gorge in the UK. So in the UK, this would be the equivalent of uh, the Grand Canyon, but of course in the UK everything's not quite as uh, grand, should we say. So this is what we've got instead, but it's quite popular for people coming out uh, coming out in various vehicles and things like that and driving up and down the gorge. It's also popular with people just to come and have a look really because it's quite impressive. But it's, it is good for driving in, so let's see. We have to avoid hitting German and Belgian drivers and things like that. And various tourists as well, but it is quite an impressive place and it's a good uh, place to drive out the Jeep and enjoy it. So uh, let's have a look then. Count how many donut marks and skid marks you can see on the road. Every couple of weeks there's another car crashed into a bit of rock, which is quite funny. Where the chavs come out and uh, have a drive and end up just nailing themselves straight into the rocks. But it's a nice place to take the Jeep. We're at 180 degrees F at the moment, so let's see how we get on. It's about 28 degrees uh, Celsius here. So it's pretty warm for the Jeep. Just keep it climbing up gently. Enjoy. Right, we've got our first target sighted. Accelerating easily up the hill. Who are they? Germans. No, Belgians again. I have to change down into first. There you go. Oh no, they're having a problem. This bit's a tight bit here. You gotta be careful. Right, we'll pull in for a second and let the Germans get ahead of us. When we can find somewhere. Here we go. Let's let them all get ahead of us a bit. Right, I think the Germans are slightly ahead of us at least, anyway. Woo -wee. Yeah, there's some steep bits. Yeah, some of it is challenging for the Jeep, especially with that start there in second. German sighted. They didn't get very far. No match for Ford Jeep power. There you go guys, that's up and down the uh, gorge then. We'll head back down then and have a look what it's like on the way down. About 200 degrees F on the climb there, so that's not too bad. It's a bit taxing sometimes, you're going really slow at the bottom of the 20, uh, excuse me, the bottom of the second gear range. It's hard on the Jeep there, you really need to change down into first, but unless you're double D clutching, you really got to stop for that, so um, it's not ideal really. I probably do need to practice more first gear double D clutching, but, um, I don't really want to risk just uh, damaging the uh, first gear teeth and everything. I mean, I could, but 
I was putting a load of work into the uh, transmission. I don't want to be damaging it, so uh, we'll see. But on the way down then, the uh, gearbox and the transmission is going to be back driven quite a lot, so it's pretty, uh, pretty hard on it here and on the brakes as well. And on the steering. We've got to have sharp and precise steering here, guys. It's 30 down here. She's doing well. Another enemy sighted. At least it's another Ford. Right, coming up to the uh, some of the sharp bits here, guys. Probably down in second in a sec. That's all right. Oh, this is the steep bit for second. It's a bit much, but we'll downshift now. You can hear second gear coming in there. Feeding the accelerator back in around the corner. Yeah, it's a pretty steep bit there. At slow speed in second, that's pretty harsh on the Jeep, really. Uh, here's the really, uh, you've got to be careful on this bit if somebody comes around the corner. 180 degrees Fahrenheit now, so it's cooled down on the way down. as the Jeep's been up and down the gorge ever. Not that saying much. <laughs> Look at that. 